Good morning, everybody. Welcome along. Monday here, and uh, I woke up feeling sick again today. I don't think I ate anything out of order yesterday. I think it's to do with my stoma. I think I have to bite the bullet, ring 999, and get someone to come and take me in and have an operation. But we will see. We will see. Well, uh, I'm sitting here watching. Um, the weekend's episode of Beat the Chasers. Because apparently there's a, an elderly woman on here who's uh, calls a stink. Because she had to have a chair to sit down to play the game. Now, when she won, she stood up and sort of went, yay, like that, and walked off. And uh, Bradley called her a scammer. And uh, they've, uh, they've complained about Bradley's behaviour. Well, I find that very, very hard to think that Bradley could be anything else but a gentleman. What do you think? Do you like Bradley Walsh? Do you? Do you think he's very, very clever? I do. I love his uh, series Breaking Dad, where him and his son go off around the world and try different things out. I'd like to try that with my son, but he does live on the other side of the world. He lives in Oregon in America. And uh, the only time we talk is on Facebook, really. from Facebook Messenger. Speaking of which... I spoke to the Happy Gang again yesterday for the first time in a couple of months. They all seem to be doing very well, and they're all going to Blackpool this Friday, which will be very nice for them. It's uh, Gavin's and Terry's birthday this week, so I'm sure they'll have some fun. I know Joey and Amelia are going with them, because I've just come back from Ireland. Oh, what a uh, trip they had getting there. They told me they got the train from Preston uh, to Hollyhead. But because it was running late, they had to get off the train in mid-flight and get a taxi to take them to Hollywood, Hollywood, Hollyhead, which cost them about 150 quid. And when they was coming back, they had to do exactly the same, which cost them over another 100 odd quid for a taxi. As we said, it's got more money than sense. I definitely wouldn't pay £150 for a taxi. I'd rather get the later ferry, but that's life. You live and learn, you live and learn. Hello. Oh, did you say hello? Oh, Tracy says hello, everybody. Speaking to her baby, which will be Tigger. Yeah. Well, it seems like Siobhan had a fantastic time at the uh, Fearless Fun. Uh, Tracy showed me a photo yesterday of them sitting all around a big table eating their dinners. Now, it looks like they had sausage, mash, peas and sweet corn. But it's the look on Siobhan's face, isn't it? Absolutely blinding. As if to say, no chicken nuggets. Uh, and then they, uh, they had a campfire and camp songs. And we've got a video of them all singing. Um, what are they singing? Hello? What were they singing last night? No fly on me. Obviously, obviously not sunny enough. No. Well, anybody watch any of the Isle of Wight Festival on TV? Duran Duran and Snow Patrol were absolutely first class. And if you was into your motorsport yesterday on ITV, at two o'clock, you could have seen Goodwood Revival live. Yes, yeah, Sterling Moss and company. Absolutely fantastic. That's where our local radio station, B2, has been broadcasting from. All weekend until uh, last night. And this morning, my lovely friend Millie is back with The Secret Sound. If you don't know what I'm on about, have a look at their website, v2radio.co.uk. Click on the menu tab and go down to Secret Sound. You could win yourself a lot of money. A lot of money. But, um... Oh, yeah. I really don't know what I'm doing today, really. Um, I know we're changing the plan of me nurse coming out. Today will be the last one till Wednesday and then Friday. Just going to see if 48 hours will make a difference to the dressing being on my backside. Hopefully it will. We will, we will find out. But, um, oh, she can. She can fast forward it. It's all right. I was going to say you can't do that, but you can. Hang on. I want to see what it says. 
this and sometimes greed is not good. Hegarty's victim. Go with the offer you're most comfortable with. Was that the woman? Who knows? Right, we'll speak to you tomorrow. Take care. Ta-ra.